Hello, and welcome to Grunt Gaming, and welcome back to our Let's Play of Elden Ring. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. You've been around. Thanks for watching. Uh, we are here in the Caleb Catacombs. Down here, we ran some from some vicious dogs to get down in here. Uh, in the meantime, thought I heard a word set. Oh, it's that torch. That's what I'm hearing. Okay. Uh, in the meantime, uh, I went ahead and I upgraded our Lutel the Headless uh, to plus four. Uh, I also upgraded... Uh, what did I upgrade? I upgraded our Radon Soldiers to plus three. And I went and made a bunch of arrows. Just in case we need them. So let's stop here at the Sight of Grace. Let's go ahead and I think we have enough to get another flask. We do! Alright, that'll give us another uh, crimson flask. So that's going to be a nice little boost to us. And let's get down into these catacombs and see what's up. Okay, we got the summoning pool. Uh, we've also, um, I've joined the Seekers group. I put in the Seeker's password, so uh, we'll see how things go. I don't think... I shouldn't have done that, actually. Now I think I can be invaded. I don't know how that works. But we'll find out. Uh, so what do we got in here? Ah, Scarlet Rot. That's awful. Can you stand... Okay, so we stand here. No Rot. We got Rot Flowers. What do these do? Okay, these are just like the other Rot Flowers. It looks like. Yeah. This is not going to be a fun dungeon. At all. Uh, how much damage do these take from our bow? Okay. So. We have a solution for this problem. Really? Let's, let's get out of the rot area. There we go. Now we can go ahead and clear these out. Should probably upgrade this short bow. Really? Thank you, Flower. That might be on the list of things to do. There we go. Alright, so if we run up here, we're safe. Oh, it's so dark in here. There we go. That's better. Over here, some root resin, grave glovewort four. Oh, we need that to upgrade our our guys even higher. That's awesome. Uh, so we got to watch out for scarlet rot everywhere. Uh, also, now that we're in the seekers, we might get some better. Like I think that's a blood stain from somebody in our password group. Oh, hello. He tried. He really did try. Good job, Ghosty. Alright. A little bit of Grave Glove Wart. Always. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, our message got appraised. That's handy. Where is. Oh! That's right! They reform. I was like, what the heck? Don't forget, we always have our Holy Sword if we need it. Gotta remember that. Especially when we start getting overwhelmed with Skellingtons. A little bit of Grave Violet. Got all kinds... Oh, I'm sure there's nonsense down below here. Oh, that's all Scarlet Rot, isn't it? Oh, no. And be wary of ranged battle. Oh, this is terrible. And we can't... Alright, ranged battle... Oh! That's what they're talking about. There's... Oh! Hello! Who are you? Oh, no. Really? Listen. 
So we got a problem here. This is gonna be upsetting. Okay, that thing is... Does it move? Can I hit it from here? Oh, that does so little damage, comparatively. Uh, I think they respond negatively to fire arrows. Let's try out some fire arrows. So look, we would have scar we would be covered in scarlet rot from that at this point. Do you, do you mind? Can you stop? That's ridiculous. All right, so yeah, fire sets them on fire, and they have bad times. And this would take a million arrows to kill it. Okay, let's just go in here. What do we got? Anything? Secret door? Thank you, our friends over at uh, the Seekers. Miranda Sprout Ashes. I think that's the Scarlet Rot Flowers, these things. Okay. So, fighting these is not worth it. We're just going to run past them will be the plan. Look how much rot we picked up just from that. Okay. Well, really? This is going to keep going? Are we covered in it or something? Like, why won't it stop going up? Stop going up. Okay. It finally stopped. Goodness, that's just silly. Grab those, and get out of here. And now, see, whenever somebody beats a shard bearer, we get a, a bonus on the number of souls that we get. So, that's another little side benefit for what we've got going on here. Uh, Alright, this is more Scarlet Rot everywhere. Grab that, and then get over here. Nope, this is not... Is there nowhere? Stake America. But we still haven't opened this door. So we didn't go the right way? Is there a path that we missed? Oh, right there. That was easy enough. Huh. Well, we're going to have to fight against some rot here. So let's get our flask fill. Let's see what kind of boss we're up against. Hopefully our newly improved headless man will be awesome. Of course, this is going to be Scarlet Rot and we won't have enough to undo it when it shows up. Oh, it's another one of these guys, a cemetery shade. Okay. Luckily, woo! Oh, this is bad. Something's bad. Luckily, we now have our super upgraded dude. Look at the damage he does. That is impressive. Oh, he's got enough hit points to withstand being attacked. Yeah, what are you gonna do about it, shade? What are you gonna do? You got me and a super ghost. You got nothing. Yeah, upgrading him was definitely worth it. Because we definitely needed the upgrade. Uh-oh. There we go. Yeah. Nice little final backstab from us to finish him off. And then we felled the Kindred of Rot Ashes. Ooh, good job, Headless Man. Good job. Uh, the Kindred of Rot. Oh, are those those bug dudes? Are they a ghost? What are they? Okay, they're here in the second tier. Right? There we go. Kindred of Rot. Ashen remains in which spirits yet dwell. This spirit takes the form of a crawling pest. It's shit in this body. Or chitinous, depending on how you want to say it. Um... Making a dry rustling sound. Attacks enemies by secreting sticky threads. The kindred of rot are the servants of the goddess of rot. Servants that have been forsaken. And we got this. What are these? Miranda sprouts. Five Miranda sprouts. 
Summoning these consumes hit points rather than focus points. Really? Spirits of sweet little Miranda flowers, carnivorous blossoms that feed upon human flesh, they creep slowly, scattering toxic pollen, vulnerable to fire. Do take care of the little darlings. Is there anybody else? I've never noticed that. Is that the first thing that ever does? Yeah! That's the first thing we've ever picked up that does something different than focus points. It does hit points instead. Well, that's cool. Uh, what do we got here? Anything worth picking up? Just your regular garbage. Nothing else. Alright. Cool. No root resin down here? That surprises me. I would have thought there would have been root resin here. Okay. Well, back to the entrance. A fun little boss fight. Man, upgrading that guy was so worth it. I'm trying to remember now where we got Ghost Glove Wart because that was amazing. We got plenty of Grave Glove Wart here. Um, but the Ghost Glove Wart, mm, that's the stuff that really did it. All right, back out here in Kaled. Let's do this, uh, because if we go this way, I think we're going to be running back into those dogs, won't we? Oh! What in the... Please focus on the bird, Grug. Oh, that's the grab. I forgot. When he raises his beak and his foot in the air. That that's the grab. Gotta remember that. We're not dying to you. We just fought a boss. You're nothing, bird. Out. Whoop! Come on, bird! Take the sword to the face. Oh! We missed. Oh man, these things are so... They're not that difficult. They're just kind of sporadic. We fought them plenty of times. Right, luckily, he replenished our flasks. Oh, we never... Oh, we're just going to keep going. Whatever. I'm not going to a site of grace after that. Let's see what's over this way. All right, there's the statue that led us here. There's the path of many dogs. Oh, is this a... Oh, that's just more of Caleb. Ugh. So icky. Oh! Got a dude on a horse. Hello, dude on a horse. Oh, he shoots fire. I should have guessed that from the fire weapon, but... Scary. He had a cool-looking shield, though. Okay. So up there we've got a big sword. Here we have all those dogs where they've attacked the camp of soldiers. Oh, there's a there's a beetle over here somewhere. Probably up there. That's going to be my guess. Yeah. Oh, I heard a bird. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what's happening? Are the soldiers fighting the dogs? Yes, they are. Let's use this moment to not get involved. Are there any items to pick up over here? There's one. A smoldering butterfly. Otherwise, we have this giant... Oh, they're fighting the dogs and burning them. Okay. Well, that's kind of cool. I 
think there's a beetle up here. I'm almost positive. There he is. And he's meant to run you right into this nonsense. Come on, Grug. Kill the beetle. Got him. Ash of War Crag Blade. Well, we'll check that out in a bit. Because we've already been to the site of Grace down there. But we didn't get up inside that tower yet. But what's going on over here? There we go. The Star Scourge Conflict, Redan alone holds Stella secure and stands tall to shatter the stars. Well, that may have been true at one point, but not anymore. We have uh, removed him from existence. Uh, any chests or anything down here? Looks like there's a ladder up there. Oh, what's that? Oh, we got. Oh, that's that teleporter. Okay. We've used this teleporter. We've been across this bridge before. This is a cool looking bridge, but... And then this goes to the entrance into Radon's castle. And then over there is the beach where we fought Radon. Alright. Well, let's check out this tower. There's got to be something inside this tower. Grab this. Let's try getting up on top here. Now there are guys at the very top of these ladders, so I don't know if... Okay, they're not shooting at me. They're shooting way out there at the dogs. So I wonder, can we ever so sneakily climb up here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get off the ladder, Grug. You get down. Alright. Problem solved. That wasn't too bad. That was manageable. There's got to be a prize for going up here. Hello, sir. I see that you have friends. Oh, mistimed that, but that's okay. Down you go. Some Radon Soldier Greaves. Awesome. And a Scarlet Tabard. And the Arrow's Sting Talisman. Well, let's see here. So we got an Ash of War. This one. Cragblade. Grants... Ah, uh, yeah. There we go. Skill manipulates gravity, bury the armament in the ground, pulling rocks from the earth to reinforce it, increases attack power, and makes it easier to break enemy stance. Ooh, that's kind of neat. Uh, and we picked up uh, this right here. Worn by foot soldiers in General Radon's army. We also picked up Rust Worn and Stained throughout any conflict. Conflict. And where's the talisman we just got? There we go. Arrow Sting. Raises attack power of arrows and bolts. Okay. There's going to be more up higher. Let's keep going. What's here at the very top? Really? Could this be a sniping spot? I don't know. You tell me. Is there anything we can see, though, that we can get to from here? Nope. That's just going to be useful, you know, <clears throat> multiplayer or something you want to hide somewhere. Nice little spot to hide. Cool. 
definitely worth the effort to get up there. Make sure there's nothing in this camp that we're missing. No chests or anything. Oh, hello. A mushroom. That's fine. Can't complain about free mushrooms. They are delicious. Oh, can't quite get up there. Okay, that's fine. We'll leave these guys to fight those dogs. And... Let's cross that bridge while we're here. Because we skipped most of Verdon's castle previously. When we were here. Because we used the teleporter. As opposed to... Actually, going up to the castle. Let's head towards some of this fire. Ah, there's another tower here. Okay. Yeah, we skipped this whole area previously. Not hearing any... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yep, that's what I thought. Level 3 smithing stones. I think level 5 is what we need for our sword. But if we ever wanted to upgrade a secondary weapon... Uh, is there a ladder on this tower? Is there no ladder? I have to, oh, you gotta jump on it from above. Okay. So we're gonna have to get here from up top. Well, that's that's a thing. Who knows what kind of enemies will be coming up here, though. None, apparently. There's no one guarding this camp. Radon soldiers must all be dead. Huh. Alright, well, over here is the obvious way onto that tower. I think I hear a beetle. Smithing stone level six. Aha! Well worth it. Give me them level six stones, I tell you what. Oh, and by the way, I found out what that glow is around our character. When you have the buff, that gives you more... Oh, is that a secret path? Aha. Um, when you have the buff, that gives you more... More souls, that's what that glow is. What do we have over here? Path up there. Let's keep going up. Oh, hi bats. Come on, buddy. Come on, come down here. Thank you. Jerk. Add that level 3 golden rune to our collection. Let's 
see a lot of blood stains up here, so let's be careful. Obvious trap is obvious. Too high up ahead. Oh yeah, don't fall. Oh, it's like a little... Yeah, don't fall down there. Couple bats. Still the worst. Oh, it's one of these! Shoot! I didn't see her in time. Oh, I did not see her in time. Alright, where's the other bat? Deal with him first. Okay, I'm not worried about a little bit of poison. That's... Easily cured. What are you doing, lady? Come here. Oh, she has a grab. Oh my goodness, that is so much help. Okay, just run in past the poison and kill her, drug. She's the worst. Alright, there's the beetle that I've been hearing. The Ash of War, Flaming Strike. Ooh, that sounds fancy. Smoldering Butterflies. Michaela's Lily. And we got a path up into the castle there, too. Uh, there and there. A couple different paths, actually. Uh, let's take a look here. Oh, there must be a locked door somewhere. Okay. Well, let's take a look. Well, we do. Um, we just got this Ash of War. Flaming Strike, skill that emits flame and a wide forward arc. Follow up with a strong attack to perform a lunging, sweeping strike. This will also coat the armament in fire. Well, that's cool. Is there going to be a locked door up here? Yeah. Hey, buddy. How you doing? That did not open the door. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> no biggie. Didn't expect it to. Uh, let's go up this ladder over here. Okay, we've already beat Radon, so it's kind of weird. It's like Kodrick's Castle, where we had to go back to Stormvale Castle and do a bunch of looking around after we beat the boss. That's how the game is meant to be played. Alright, here we are, Redmain Castle... Here's stuff moving around. I hear a beetle. Beetle's probably up there. What do we got down here? Anything on the ground? Nope. We got an evil lion over there. I love the music here. I don't know if you can hear it on my audio levels, but it's pretty good. Alright, nothing there. Nothing behind us. Looking for a way to open that front portcullis, I think. Oh, 
Oh wait, I know exactly where we are. Because we've been through that door. I'm pretty sure. Alright, let's deal with this dog. Come on, dog. Entry there. Oh, hello. Bunch of guys in here. Bunch of those flame pot throwing guys, actually. So this is that door to those stairs. Okay. Smithing stone five. That's what we need. And the armorous cookbook number five. We can make immunizing cured meat and immunizing white cured meat. Uh, that would help deal with the rot. That's useful. I'm gonna go left. Uh, summoning pool. Let's check out this left hand side here. No idea what we're getting into. Dude right there with a crossbow. Oh! He does a double! How not nice of you! Page garb? Where is that? There it is. Traveling wear tailored with exquisite precision to avoid any undue shame for the page's master. Garb worn by pages who serve the nobility and are mindful to keep them out of harm's way. I hear somebody moving around. In armor. It's not me. It's so dark in here. There's this tiny little room. There's nothing in here. Why is this tiny room here? Oh, there's two of those lion things out there. Okay. Maybe this is here just so you can see there are two. So you don't go rushing out into that. Unaware and unprepared. Hmm. I wonder. So from up here. Can't get up on there. But you can drop down here, I bet. Yeah. So, like, you can do this. This way. What I'm 
people in our password group has uh, defeated a boss. That's neat. So defensible spot here. So I wonder, can we trigger one of these guys? Not with my... Probably not with my short range, but... Yeah, we hit him. I think it might be on. Or not. Right, we're gonna have to deal with this. We can't not deal with it. Okay, we got those two things over there. Where does this go? Why is there a big swirly mist up there? Because that's the teleporter that brought us in, and up here is where we fought Radon. Okay. That's fine. But I don't think we went up here. In fact, I can almost guarantee we didn't go up here. We can't get in through here. Okay. Oh, this is going to be a maze-like place. Well, let's go deal with those dogs maybe next. Yeah. There's a Sight of Grace over that way. This is where we teleport it in. But it's like cordoned off. There's a lot of different paths you can take here. I want just one of these. Like, I don't want to fight two at once. At all. I have no wish to fight two. Oh no. Oh no no. Not both. Okay. Let's see how this goes. Oh no. Okay, we gotta heal. Oh, we are not... We are not impressive to this guy at all. Alright, so he does pretty much two attacks each time. Oh, wow. We are... This corner is bad for our health. <laughs> I can't see anything. There we go. Woo! Right, he does two attacks. Come on, Grub. Just said it out loud a minute ago. Oh, broke our guard. Woo! lot going on here. Okay, then he'll do two more. Or not. Wow, he does impressive damage. And these guys respawn, if I remember correctly. 
I just mistimed that. Uh, I was hoping just for a quick hit to finish him off. That's a bad healing timing. All right. We got a somber smithing stone four, beast blood, and an old fang. And that took a ton of resources. I don't know that we can handle the second one. At all. I wonder if we can... Just kinda... You know. Ah, okay. Maybe you can... No. Ah, there it is. They give us refills? Okay. Perhaps... Perhaps with that refill, we might have enough resources to take on the second beast. In fact, I think we might have enough. Let's try for it. Shall we? I think we should. Or... Let's be sneaky for a moment. If we could find a way to open these doors... We have no way to open them. I think that's the entrance over there. That's not going to get us anywhere. Wait, you can't... Uh... Yeah, no horsing. No horsing around in here. Okay. Uh-oh, something bad's happening. Oh, it's one of these. I don't, I'm not wasting my time with you. Alright, I think... Well, actually, we gotta get rid of you before you cause a problem. As much as I hate to do this... It's just weird, because you can't really tell where the front is. Hello. Ow. That was silly. Come on. Where's the front? Oh, it's way over there. Okay. Dealt with that problem. Okay, let's heal. Let's take care of this guy. Now that we kind of understand how he fights a little bit better... I wish we could get a free hit on him. Two hits. There we go. He's got a big one. That's fine. We're good. We're good. I can't. <laughs> Too close. Okay. Come on, buddy. Bad timing. That's fine. We're still good. We're still good. Okay. Bad timing on that one. Two hits. We get our hit in, and we're good. Okay. Ah. Poorly timed. Poorly timed. We need to heal. Bad healing. Two hits. Ah. See, we don't get the block. Uh-oh. Grug. Stop it. We don't get the quick strike is the problem. Grug, don't die to this thing right now. Okay. Okay. Ow. Oh, good try, game. Aha!
That's okay. We're okay. We're not okay. We're not okay. There we go. There we go. So, other than having to fight one of these again. Like, what is our reward? Because these things are the worst. I'm sure there's a better way to kill these, and I just am not understanding, but that's okay. We have no healing left. Smithing stone four. I'm cool with that. So, like, what's our reward for killing these bosses? I mean, we got all those little items off of them. But is there a ladder we can now access over here that we can look around? Can we get up somewhere we couldn't reach before? Nope, that all goes kind of that way. Nothing you can really do here that's new. I don't know why I keep trying to get my horse out, but that's okay. So you'd go this way. Oh, maybe you could jump across over there. Ah, looks like there might be a path up there. Okay. Maybe. So you come around here. Come to the left. Oh, okay. You go to the left. Okay. Over this way. You can go up here. Try trap and then time for head. I don't get it. Oh, maybe you could try plunging attacks on the two beasts on the ground. Smithing so stone four. I'm worried because I'm seeing a bunch of. Uh, be wary of right. Dog ahead. Oh yeah, dog on the right. I bet you. Nothing over here? Nothing. What is up with all these doors that I cannot open? Keeps telling me people keep saying they need to find a key. I have no idea. Huh. I mean I kinda wanna keep looking around while we have this area cleared out. Because up here is Here's the Sight of Grace. Let's see. Here's the entrance to where we fought Radon. 
you have anything new to say since we uh, we beat him? No. I wonder if Alexander's over here still. I mean, here's all the guys that fought with us in the battle. Alexander is no longer here. Is this guy still here? No, he's gone. The dude who gave the big speech. So, yeah. I mean, there's a lot of this castle we can't seem to get into. Oh, he's up here now. He's just chilling. What's up, buddy? At last, the war festival has ended. Brave champion, you have our gratitude. The celebration was spectacular. General Radan is surely Festering with rot and crippled by madness. All he wanted was an honorable death. Finally, my work is done. I'm no longer bound to this fortress. I have a task in mind. Old business, you could say. You wouldn't understand. May we meet again if the fates deign it. Brave champion. It's time I went on my way. May we meet again if the fates deign it. Brave champion. It's time I may we meet Alright. No new dialogue from him. I was hoping maybe he would give us a key. This door doesn't go anywhere. Yeah, there's something that we're missing to this whole area. Unless they just cut parts of it off because they decided, hey, we don't need to do these, but there was an item behind one of those doors. I really want to figure out how to open that door. I'll give it another couple minutes of looking around. Like there's a walkway up there, you can get across up there. like we're missing some kind of key element to this. Jump up there? Not through here. That's way too high to jump. There is some key to this that I am missing. How do we find the things we need in life? Not up there. I'm going to check one more spot, and then we'll probably end the episode if I can't, you know, advance at all. We might be done. We might be done here. I may have to look up, you know, what to do at this point. If you want to get into these other parts. Because so far... Dead end, dead end, dead end. We haven't raised the portcullis. There wasn't a lever over here, right? Something stupid that we missed? Nope. Well, let's check one last thing. Because there's no enemies on the outside of this castle. Maybe. Just maybe. What I'm missing is at the front. At the front of the castle. We're, we're kind of being dumb by not... Uh, not going to the front door. So let's just check that real quick. Oh. That's new. That was not there before. <laughs> this is completely different. There was never that before. 
was there? And I just didn't notice it? Where are we? Wait, what's... What's happening? None of this was here before. There's like a... I hear a giant yelling. <laughs> what is going on? This is all completely different. Is it because it's daytime as opposed to nighttime? Like a hundred percent. You we were all here. None of this was here. <laughs> well folks, I have no idea what's going on. Uh, let's just see if there's any items around here to grab that we missed. And then we're gonna go home. Alright. Yeah, I have no idea. None of these enemies were spawned in last time we came here. Oh! Oh! Well, for some reason, the game decided that we were just gonna have it real easy. And not have to deal with that the first time, so I'll take it. I have no idea what that's about. Oh, our 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 horse. Get up, get out of the way, Grug. Yeah. Unless it's maybe that's oh, that's why there were so many blood stains here. Maybe if you come at night, that's what it is. At night time, maybe none of this is here. Let's let's test that theory real quick. I want to see something. So if you come back here, that'd be really interesting if that was the case. Because we never have seen any enemies here before. Um, but every time we've come here, it's been nighttime. Nope! Huh. Well! I'm not sure... <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm not sure what has changed and why there are now enemies there when there never were before. Uh, but that's pretty wild. Alright, well that's where we'll wrap up this episode. Uh, until next time, I'm going to say thanks for watching. Please tell your friends. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, we hope to see you soon.